Filling flash is flattering if it's done subtly. The flash gently lifts shadows and creates a shine in the eyes known as a catch light. It's achieved using a flash gun with a variable output. The camera is set up as if taking a picture using the available light. Make sure the shutter speed will synchronise with the flash, for example a sixtieth of a second. The flash output is set to an aperture value two to three stops wider than that set on the camera, dropping its power. When overdone, fill in flash creates a second shadow under the chin and it overpowers the natural light. Some digital cameras need less flash power than you expect. The flash gun can also be fooled by the subject brightness, so make a test exposure and drop the power or close the aperture as needed. Another technique is to use flash to light the subject while underexposing the background, typically by a stop or two, to increase its saturation. The flashlight is more flattering if it is bounced off a reflector. The flash has to illuminate the subject fully, so it is set to the same aperture as the camera. The shutter speed is then shortened by a couple of stops to reduce the background light bleeding into the shot. Flash also helps to freeze subject movement, so you can borrow an extra stop of shutter speed and still use a camera handheld. You normally handhold a 50mm lens at a minimum of a 60th of a second. With flash, you can drop the shutter speed to a 30th of a second, which will also help background light to bleed in and add atmosphere. As the shutter speed is extended, background movement becomes more apparent. But it is mixed with the freezing effects of the flash on the subject. This is known as slow synchronisation flash. Typically, it is used at around a fifteenth or an eighth of a second. The camera can be panned to follow a moving subject and the longer the shutter speed, the more blurred background movement becomes. This technique can be varied by jogging or rotating the camera during exposure. Flash vignetting makes the edges of an image darker than the centre. The flash gun needs to be focused for use with a relatively long lens, like 70mm, but used with a relatively short lens, like 35mm. This makes the flash fade.